What's up, everybody? This is Bob Shank. So today we're doing final version of the Battle of Issei in my Samurai Warriors 1 walkthrough. So we are going to do the hardest one. This is by far the hardest one to do. And it's going to be the one where we have to basically fail everything at the start of this level in order to get the special mission. It's a pretty hard mission to ground in a sea of for our side because we're gonna have a massive barrel drop to us. so we'll make it happen it'll be fun uh thank you all so much for watching and be sure to like subscribe and comment for more that are awesome and i really appreciate each of you so i'm gonna start out by defeating this dude you shall for no reason. The true art of just battle. since it takes two to um uh, it takes two, uh, defeating two fortress defense anywhere. troops to make it uh, get on our side. I'm just going to defeat one to kind of help out Katsuie, a little bit of uh, KG and a little bit of my troops. So we're going to do that, and then I'm going to wait another eight minutes until we fail the next mission. And from there, we'll continue on. So I'll show here in the corner. And we'll have this going. So thank y'all for watching, and I'll cut to it in a second. Do not falter! We can still win! Such amazing skill! An exceptional warrior. You are truly a great warrior. would expect nothing less of you. Go to the central fortress and set it aflame. All others, protect the task force. This could get ugly. Are 
indeed a great warrior. going. All right, so obviously I don't really narrate this because I'm trying to figure out the best way to handle this. So Lady Naga has lost everything. I'm trying to get Hideyoshi to die. Hideyoshi went south, so I'm basically just patrolling right here and just destroying all of Showcase troops over and over and over again to keep Nobunaga from dying because I would expect nothing less he has no morale and Showcase morale doesn't drop at all, so I'm just basically rampaging through all of these units over and over and over again until Hideyoshi dies. That's basically how we're going to roll with this. It's not ideal, but this is how you have to kind of do this. You have to be... This is no to focus on the, If you're focusing on the missions, you kind of just have to hope that your troops survive, unlike some of them who are not. But I'm just going to keep getting a bunch of troop killed, because I can, and I have to, to keep Nobunaga alive. You are indeed a great warrior! Eventually, Hideyoshi will lose, and then we'll get the secret mission on this level, where we will have to fight our way through the battle of Issei Force Drive. And there you go. So they would sooner die than yield. Very well. Take out the surrounding fortresses and lure them. Now we're gonna move and hope that Nobunaga can survive long enough. I don't know if he'll be able to. It'll be very challenging. But we'll make it happen. I would expect nothing Very less cool. of you. I forgot about the cannon are still firing, even though we've lost literally everything down there. The cannons are still shooting. Let's save it really quickly. Nobunaga probably isn't doing very well. There is no escape now. What will you do? There's no point in resisting any further. Maybe it's time to ask Nobunaga for forgiveness. It can't be hard. Lord Nobunaga, we surrender. I ask you to show mercy and spare the lives of my men. Surrender? What folly. I'm gonna head back up to Nobunaga because he has 
very little up there with him. I'm nervous for him very much. Okay, I'm gonna secure this stronghold. Expect nothing less of you. An exceptional warrior. Continue the assault. Clear out Nobunaga's area a little bit. There we go. <clears throat> All right, so we're still moving, working on keeping everybody alive that's still alive because everybody's dying at this point. I'm gonna go. Find Shokang, there he is. And I'm gonna go get Katamasa Han Hattori up here. I wanna fight both of them at the same time. Because they both kind of are terrible. And then we're gonna do this thing. Because I want to get rid of both of them before. When the pilgrims spawn and start running, Nobunaga's gonna start moving. I don't want him to just suddenly die to nothing. Because he would literally lose to everything that's left. I don't want that. So we're gonna... He's kind of stabilized in that he has units blocking for him, which is great. But I still just can't risk it. Cannot risk it with this level. Okay. Wow, they, they literally spawn immediately. I didn't even pay attention to that last time. After them, not escape. Two left. Nobunaga's moving, which makes me nervous. This does not look good. KG's gone. Everybody's gone, basically, but that's we eh? Me and Mitsuhita doesn't really count because he's gonna retreat from the map anyway, I think like in the next two seconds. And Nobunaga is running around. He has no officers. So he literally, yeah, I, that's why I'm glad I did it this way. So if you want this, I mean, hopefully this guide helps. It's just like a walkthrough slash mission playing guide, getting all of them, completions, you name it. The goal is just to get all of this stuff done without having... I'm trying to save you guys some heartache if you're going for 100%. There we go. Some fools are beyond salvation. And I don't actually... I don't realize Mitsuhide never actually retreated that time. Maybe because we did so bad that he was like, all right, that's fine. But we got it. And thank you all so much for watching. Um, I will show you all the missions at the end, show that we beat it, and we'll call it. So thank you all for watching, and have a great day.